What is up everybody and welcome back to another tutorial. First of all, I just want to say thank you so much for 10,000 goddamn views on my BFM in 2 tutorial. Guys, I love you so much. Thank you so much. It's amazing. I really loved your support. So I'm so thankful for that. Thank you so much. But that's not what this video is about. Today I'm going to show you how to upload videos to YouTube faster. And that's pretty easy. You only need a software for this. So it's pretty simple. It 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 only takes a minute to um, do this or it actually does not. It depends on how big your file size of the video is. But I will explain that later. So what you're going to do, you will go to this link in the description and then you just go ahead and click and download. So as I said, it's a software and it's actually pretty easy. So this software does, if you have uh, a video with a huge file size, let's say uh, uh, 10 gigabytes or something, and you put it into this program, then this, or software, then this software can uh, reduce the file size of your video. And think like this, if you're uploading a video to YouTube with uh, a video that has 10 gigabytes in it and you have a shit internet connection, then it takes like... Uh, God damn it! five hours to upload that video or even more uh, and if the file size of your video is lower then it goes faster because then your internet doesn't have to uh, upload s such a huge file uh, to the internet to YouTube okay so that's actually basically what this software does so once you downloaded it just close this and then open the handbrake uh, yeah and then it looks like this what you're gonna do is you will click on or you see a source selection and then you just click on file. Now what you're gonna do is that you will find the video that you want to upload to YouTube. I have an example here. This video right here. It's from uh, Cisco. And if you look here, it's goddamn 15 gigabytes and that's so goddamn much. That's a huge file size. And with that bad internet connection that I, I, I have then it takes maybe uh, seven hours to upload this video and I don't want to spend my time on that uh, so yeah once you got your video just uh, choose it and then click and open it and, and then the software will scan it now it looks like this and you see it says ready that means the video is in the software and you're, you, you can uh, encode your video so what you're gonna do on the right hand side you see this uh, like uh, window with presets and that stuff. What you're gonna do is that you will scroll the whole way down until you see legacy and here you see that we have a tab that is called normal. Just click on normal and you're good to go. What you're gonna do now, you will click on video. You can of course look onto all those settings but I'm not gonna mess around with it. Uh, this is the place where the magic actually happens. So now we need to get a lower quality and no worries it's still hd there's there's almost no difference between uh before you put it into the software and after there's no difference actually you can't you can't really see it so what you're gonna do you will or if you now put this lower like you see a uh, constant quality 20 that's like uh what the video is right now it's on 20 let's say that uh if we make the numbers lower then the quality is getting better and then the file size also will be bigger and that's not what we want to we want a lower file size but with hd so what you're gonna do you will keep this constant quality between 30 and 20. that's the sweet spot for everyone i wouldn't go higher than that you mean i mean like 40 that's too much then you get shit quality so just keep it on 25 or something 25 is a sweet spot for me you can mess around with this if you want but i'm not gonna do that i will just leave it like this and now you can go to audio if you want and change the bitrate settings now sorry if you put this higher then the file size of course will be bigger uh but 160 is still perfect you can't hear any difference seriously it's 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 great just keep it on 160 okay and now you just click on browse 
and then you find uh, uh, the folder where we want to save this video. So I have handbrake here, but as you can see, I already have the video uh, encoded. So I already did this step. But once you got the, the video in here and you did that browse thing, then you just click and start encode and then you see like a loading bar down here. And when it's 100%, it will say Q finished and then your video is done and then you actually have a copy of your video. And now I will uh, show you the difference uh, be between before and after, okay? So let's just do that. I will quickly open all this stuff. Uh, where did I save it? Yes, right here. Handbrake, there you go. So this is before and you see 15 gigabytes if you remember that. That's goddamn expensive. And if you look after, and I did this, this video is with, made with the exact same settings in Handbrake like I showed you. And as you can see, 1.12 gigabytes. Holy Jesus fucking Christ. Damn it. That's, God damn it. Think of this. 9 gigabyte different. Wait, what? What the fuck? I'm, okay, I'm sorry. Mathematics. That's not me. I mean, I mean 14 gigabytes. Oh wait, yeah, 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 14, 14, there we got it, oh god, I'm good at math. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was uh, pretty cringe, actually, that was awkward. But okay, yeah, you see, the difference is, god damn it, that's so much, uh, that's amazing. And now you can upload this video quick, because the file size is so low. And of course, I will show the, sh the blah, blah, blah. I will show you the quality of this video, if you click on it, this is what it looks like, this is CSGO, by the way. And it looks so great. It's HD, as you can see. It's good quality. It looks pretty good, in my opinion. Uh, so um, this is this just, it's just perfect, man. You can upload this video now. So uh, yeah, just go ahead, upload your video to YouTube, and you're good to go. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you want to see more, please leave a like and subscribe. And of course, if you are new here and this video helped you out. Make sure to subscribe and leave a like, please, okay? That's good. All right. And if you have any tutorial requests, just write that in the comments down below and I will see what I can do. So yeah, thank you for watching this video and yeah, adios, amigos.